Striking casino workers could soon be marking their last day on the picket lines with a tentative deal now on the table. Good evening and thank you for being with us this Friday afternoon. I'm Glenda Lewis. It's been nearly two weeks since workers at Hollywood Casino and Motor City Casinos ending their strike and ratified deals while workers at MGM held out for more. The Casino Council and MGM finally reaching a deal last night, but as 7 Action News reporter Whitney Burney learned, some workers still remain split on whether to take the new offer. After more than 40 days on the picket lines. It has been a little bit challenging with the cold and everything, but I've been hopeful. MGM workers could be hanging up their signs and heading back to the dealer's tables. It's been an emotional, emotional roller coaster. You know, you have to realize this is the first time we've ever done this. Thursday night, the Detroit Casino Council and MGM Grand Casino finally struck a deal. It includes an immediate $3 an hour raise and an additional $2 an hour raise split over the life of the five-year contract. Negotiators also secured a one-time $2,000 bonus for full-time workers and a $1,000 bonus for part-time workers. The deal now the second offer from MGM after workers rejected a deal in November. I think we spoke loud and clear. You know, I'm on the negotiation committee and I've always stressed to everybody that the vote is the vote and you have to respect the vote. And when the people say they want more, you have to go back to the table, roll your sleeves up and try to make something happen. While some workers are excited about the prospect of increased wages. My biggest thing was our insurance and also being a single individual woman, I own my own house and everything. So being able to afford everything that I have is always a great. Not everyone is sold. I voted no for the last one. I'm voting no tomorrow. Mm. And as long as they will not offer us anything else, I'm going to continue to vote no. Catherine Bielik Roberts has been with the company for 24 years. We came back in the middle of a pandemic. Some people got sick. Some people died. And they don't appreciate us. Mm -hmm. And we deserve more than what we're getting. Other workers say they're confident this deal will end the strike. We can go back into this building with our heads hung high and we can continue to do the great job we've been doing. And I feel this contract, I am proud of it. And I do pray that it goes through. A ratification vote is set up for tomorrow. If the contract goes through, the union says they still have to decide exactly when workers will make it back into the casino. Reporting here from downtown Detroit, Whitney Burney, 7 Action News.